Hey guys, G for T, George for Title TV, and Naked Baby TV. And uh, please excuse the camera if it shakes, but I gotta do this video really quick. Uh, I ride my bike every day, and uh, I don't know what's going on, but there is some sort of secondary wave of foreclosures happening right now. And um, I haven't done any of the research, the statistical stuff. That's probably ahead of the curve like I, like I usually am uh, with the crap that hits the street first, but I can tell you right now, massive, massive wave of people losing their homes. And these are the bank foreclosures, not, uh, you know, not, not just selling to a third party uh, because you see it, they're all beat up, the garages are open, the, uh, the bank signs are on the front of the properties. And uh, it, it's like I've never, it's, it's like this is like two or three years ago. It's, it's happening over again. So I don't know what the talk is about the recovery. We're seeing like a structural default in, in real estate. I mean, houses in this area used to go for like 350 easy. Now we're down to like um, um, under 200, like 170, I, I hear. It's like 170. And a lot of the people thought they were getting a deal a year ago, but they're seeing it stagnate. Actually, they're seeing it decline. So let me try to explain to you what I think is happening. Right now, we are going through people that uh, have owned their houses for a long time. I mean, these are houses that I've seen of people that I know have been there 20 plus years. There's something structurally wrong with the economic situation. Uh, it's probably uh, the uh, ba baby boomers getting sick um, and they're having to transition to, you know, assisted living. Um, it, it, it is uh, families that have been able to subside for a long period of time, but their jobs are just structurally gone. Um, for those of you, why it's important to you guys is a lot of you own real estate, and I know a lot of you are hoping that we've hit the bottom. And here's the problem. We may have hit a bottom, but the bottom may be kind of like doing this. You know, like where it's all based upon jobs. And America is not, no longer a job creator, so I think we have a huge uh, loss to come in real estate. I think what happened in Detroit where you can buy houses for five or $10,000, I think you're gonna start seeing that all over the country where real estate is going to be uh, not an investment, it's gonna be a monthly payment. So how on earth can you as a Californian be paying a fourteen, fifteen, seventeen hundred dollar payment for a three bedroom, two bath when you know you can go to another part of the country and uh, pay half that. Um, and the same thing with rent. I'm seeing a lot of houses for rent. They're asking fourteen, fifteen hundred dollars. Remember, we're inland of Orange County, inland of Los Angeles, in San Diego, and um, you know people are still working, but there is this general uneasiness of people that are in the workforce, especially if you're in the private sector. Hell, if you're in the public sector, same damn thing. And all this uneasiness is playing itself out into reality on the street and that's what I'm seeing here. So I don't know how to emphasize this anymore. I don't know what's going on, but I see and with my own eyes a massive wave of foreclosures, a secondary wave from what we saw two or three years ago. So once you guys, uh, you know, kind of this is interactive video here, uh, let me know what you guys know. You've been... Okay, great. I gotta go. Bye.